Oh, that's not gonna work. <laughs> Lexi here. If you guys followed us during the off season, you know that all Hunter talked about was his life juice, aka cold brew. Since we've gone to Arizona for spring training, he has not been able to find cold brew. Every time he goes to a Starbucks or a cafe, they've run out on him. So I thought I'd make it easy on Hunter, make it at home, so all he has to do is go to the fridge. This definitely takes 24 hours to make, so plan in advance. I took 16 tablespoons of coarsely grounded coffee beans and I put them in the bowl and I used Intelligentsia House Slim Coffee for this one. Right? Yeah. And then I took one liter of filtered water and slowly poured it all over and evenly on the beans. So now that it's been 24 hours, um, I have to filter the coffee from the beans because you don't want all that muck in your drink, obviously. This is about to get mustard. I'm just gonna take this here. I bought this yesterday at Target. I'm sure you can get it on Amazon. I'll put a link below. I'm going to take this bowl of schmuck. Try that one more time. We'll just call it a schmuck and just pour it directly into this bowl. All right, and I'm gonna make sure to get all of the beans in there just so I can make sure all of the good juices come out. Oh yeah good stuff here. Some real good stuff. Now I have to get this to the sink which is over there. Okay now now that we have the first part of the filtration process done we're gonna need a wet paper towel and this little siphon thingy that you used before and you're gonna put the wet paper towel so it helps in just the um, draining process. Also, if you guys want to be really good to the earth, you can save your coffee grinds to put in some trees or in the soil. And you're going to pour the coffee right into it. This literally makes you want to pee. I can't even right now, you guys. I cannot even. Whew, that took forever. All right, so now that you have it finally brewed and double filtrated, looks pretty good to me. I'm gonna go ahead and put it into here. Can you look? Oh gosh. I wish there was a better way to do this. It's too wide, it's too wide. Maybe if I, I don't know. Gosh, I'm so nervous. Oh, maybe if I... Is that going in or out? Okay. Oh. There you have it, homemade cold brew. Only took about 25 hours with the prep. Now this has been sealed in a glass jar. I'm gonna put it in the fridge and this is good for about three days. But let's be real, Hunter will probably drink all of this tomorrow. You know, speaking of Hunter, let's jump to tomorrow morning and see how Hunter likes it. Hey guys, it's future Lexi and with future Hunter and we're gonna try the homemade cold brew. Cold brew day. I can't believe we made our own home brewed cold brew. I'm so excited. Alright, am I ready to take yep, it? Yep, you go for it. It's pretty darn good. We did it! We did it! We made We. You did it. Well, I watched. I was here when you poured it and stuff. As far as taste, the taste alone, I'm gonna give it a bump. Seven and a half. It's a solid cold brew. I'll take seven and a half for my first time making cold brew. Back to you, past Lexi. Oh, welcome back, guys. Well, hopefully. Hunter enjoyed the cold brew so I can give future self a pat on the back. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys like this video, please be sure to hit that like button and let me know in the comments below if you guys want to learn how to make coffee with a pineapple twist. Just let me know in the comments. Also, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please be sure to do so because we have so much fun here every single week. And I'll see you guys in the chat. Bye!
this subscription. OMG! Alright. Let's do it. <laughs>